pulmonary chondrohematoma is a benign, well circumscribed, and usually solitary lesion uh, of the lungs. It is the most common benign tumor in the lungs, and it uh, it consists of uh, hyaline cartilage, which is slightly disorganized. And uh, another important component are these epithelial clefts, cleft-like spaces lined by normal respiratory type of epithelium. Uh, sometimes we can find uh, squamous type of uh, metaplasia, we can find cuboidal cells without cilia or non-ciliated cuboidal epithelium, but the respiratory type of epithelium is the most common. Another important component um, is the presence of, these, of adipose tissue, so here we, here we see these adipocytes. Uh, often we can find the fibrous tissue, and quite common is also this myxoid type of tissue, which is the loose, uh, loose tissue made out of spindle-shaped or stellate-shaped cells uh, with uh, uh, this loose uh, substance made out of ground substance or hyaluronic, hyaluronic acid. So this is myxoid, myxoid stroma. Around the tumor, we can clearly recognize the normal pulmonary parenchyma made out of uh, alveolar spaces and also bronchioli uh, together with some blood vessels. Um, hamartoma is a lesion uh, <clears throat> which is some, some sort more sort of uh, non-neoplastic malformation more than, a, uh, more than the real benign tumor or a real neoplasia. However, uh, lately all sorts of homartumas were linked to uh, some chromosomal aberrations and genetic abnormalities, so now it is not clear whether a pulmonary chondrohomartoma is a true homartuma or whether it is uh, a rather a benign uh, tumor. Uh, macroscopically it looks like a um, slightly lobulated, maybe slightly irregular ball made out of cartilage. It has usually less than four centimeters in diameter and on an x-ray it looks like a coin lesion. Uh, it is a slow-growing lesion and is commonly asymptomatic. Well, it is quite important to try to find some um, atypical features uh, in the hyaline cartilage and in a normal pulmonary chondrohomartoma, all these cells, all these chondrocytes are completely bland. We do not see mitotic figures. We do not see ATP of the nuclei. So uh, all of the cells are bland chondrocytes in these lacunar spaces. Uh, this is quite important for exclusion. Malignant tumor made out of cartilage, which is chondrosarcoma. Uh, if we find, a, or if we, if we have a ball or a tumor made out of only cartilage without these clefts lined by respiratory type of epithelium. Uh, this is usually more likely um, bronchial chondroma. And bronchial chondroma is a different, um, uh, different type of tumor which is commonly as associated with carne triae. This is the syndrome where the uh, affected person has three types of tumors. Uh, we usually multiple bronchial chondromas, that's one. The second one is gastrointestinal stromal tumor and the three, uh, the third tumor is a uh, extra adrenal paranganglioma. So the three types of tumors create what we call carne triad. And uh, those bronchial chondromas are usually without these uh, epithelial clefts and they are multiple and they are more common among women normal pulmonary chondrohomartomas are more common among men. Okay, so this is uh, pulmonary chondrohomartoma and thanks for watching.